What's up, everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Shop 31 with the Punk Rock Dad. Shout out to my boy, Pop Jake. That's my dog right there. Uh, this is for him. This is Logic Therapy Music. That dude loves him some Logic, so we're going to get down with the man for a minute. Uh, you see the thing at the bottom, man? Quit fucking around, dude. Hit that like. Ooh, quit messing around. I'm cussing too early in the video, folks. They're going to get me in trouble. But, man, quit messing around. Get on top of things, dude. Come on. Come on. Get with the program. Subscribe to the channel. Comment on the video, share them with all across all your social media. Tell everybody how dumb I look, how old I am, whatever it is you gotta say to them to get them over here and look at me because they'll like me. I'm pretty fun to hang out with most of the time. Anyways, let me get this song pulled up and we'll get started, man. You guys are rad. I hope you're having a great day today. Even if you think I suck, it don't even much matter to me. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit, shit. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit, shit. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a shit, shit. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit, shit. I don't give a fuck. I don't know what that song meant, but it was tight. <laughs> you know who I want to interview on the channel so bad? Uh, Riff Raff, bro. That's my guy right there. Let's go. Come on, Logic. Come on. Oh, what a ugly-ass baby. No, I'm playing. Parker would be disappointed if I called a baby ugly. He's like, Daddy, that's not nice. Yo, I got Suicide Boys coming up. Excuse me. I got Cemetery coming up, Suicide Boys, Bones. I got all kinds of stuff coming up for you guys. And then on Tuesday and Wednesday, I got Lil Peep, Juice World. I got uh, some punk rock shit coming. Dude, it's a good week for uh, Chop 31, folks. I got them vocalists coming. I got all kinds of shit, son. Sorry. Yeah. My anxiety was taking over. Yeah. Remove the devil, let my faith go fill a slot like it's aiming dollar. I finally made it to the field of my dreams, and I let ghosts play around in my head like I'm Ray Liotta. Man. Yo, what? Why he ain't come something about Kevin Costner instead of Ray Liotta, bro? Come on, dude. Come on, man. Get with the program here. Logic. Kevin Costner's the shit, son, and he was the one that was in field. Wait, hold on. Hold on. I think Ray Liotta was in that movie too. Now, oh, I'm so dumb. Hold on. Field of Dreams cast. Yep, Kevin Costner and Ray Liotta. Sorry, Logic. I owe you an apology. My bad. Tip of the cap to you, sir. A Yankee owner, you I got, got stripes in this game. High headed, but got ice in my veins. Arriving by plane. G4 to be exact. I like the instrumental. Beats and raps. Three whores before Ford and three more being cracked. That was a life that I was leading back before I went to therapy and we impact. I wasn't really needing that. This is y'all's therapy, folks. You know, you can talk to your boy if you need somebody, okay? Now, I'm just a big Kevin Costner fan, man. That's my guy right there. Reminds me of my dad a little bit. Man, I miss my dad. All right, Pete Pops. That's my, man, I miss my dad. I wish he could have met my kids, dude. I'm going to start crying, man. I'm starting to take notes and stuff about what I want to talk about on my podcast. Sorry, I really am. I do get emotional talking about my dad and my dog. Those two things make me start crying. But uh, I'm starting to take notes on what I want to talk about on the podcast. I think I'm going to talk about the last day that I talked to my, the last thing I did to, said to my dad. Because I think y'all need to hear that story. Because I think y'all need to respect your parents a little bit more. Respect the time you have with them because you never know when it'll come to an end. You won't believe how I lost my dad. You wouldn't believe it. It's, it's so stupid. It's so fucking dumb. I was needing validation, which I agree is whack. Mad at my therapist, like, bitch, I agree with them. Here's a kicker, though, my <laughs> therapist is me. Dude, I've been there. My problems, how American and me. There's a scarcity of free thinkers. It's all group thought. That's what they think. That's not what you thought. Before huh. you saw the popular vote, you scared that the world will leave if you rock in the boat. So you I love those lyrics. That right there just got this song on the on the, on the the playlist, bro. I like that. Scared of rocking the boat and pussy ass. That's why I don't give a shit when people about cemetery fans hate on me. I don't give a fuck. I listen to that shit now. I can't help it. It's in my head now. It ain't good though. Fuck you if you like it and don't like me. We're supposed to be friends. I guess. Not really. Whatever, man. Quit. Ah! See? You don't all aboard now. You safe in here, but you don't even song. recognize your own Jake. face in here. Fuck it. Independent with a major budget. You ain't mad at me, you mad your lady love it. We should change the subject. I sway the public like I'm rapping on the it's radio. Fire, Long hair looking like I'm supposed to be on Game of Thrones. HBO. Huh. Every time I talk, it makes the news like the Daily Show. I'm wavy, so of course you want to cruise. I call it K. What's that? I'm wavy. Let's go. 
Well, it's logic. Home. All my dreams are coming true. That's something I innately know. Labels feeding all the soul dies like paleo. Meanwhile, I'm feeding myself. I had a nightmare last night that I was sleeping myself. Yeah, yeah. Uh. Oh, God. I keep my ego okay. in check. Just me and this instrumental pumping through this cassette deck. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm going to see if I can match this up. Dude, it froze again, Jake. What the hell's up with that? This shit makes me so mad. Your logic rose from Jack, but even the Titanic sank. I seen cats with egos bigger than cruise ships lose it. Gain power and abuse huh. it. Same to take my kindness for weakness and confuse it. Same type, don't know I stay with a gat and know how to use it. Used to be addicted to likes, but the likes of people I ain't even like. And huh? That's what I'm talking about. I hope I can use that part to match up the, the audio for this. Man, this shit's making me mad. But his lyrics in this song are so fire. This is honestly reminds me of that Kendrick song I just listened to. But like a little different, but it's got the same kind of like look at yourself and figure out what's going on. You know, look in the mirror before you start casting stones type of thing, you know? Anxiety reading comments, they had me read and write. Trapped in a matrix, black neo, back to the basics. Now everything I do is off the grid, they just can't trace it. Face it, I used to love rap, now all I love is my family. Fuck the fake shit. Only engulfed in darkness can you see the light like common sense. But to my defense, that way you're thinking past tense. Life's a bitch and shit can get screwed like when you camp and that's fucking intense. On tour, the fans scream in the west like craven. You know I deal with shit that I make the average man's chest cave in. On the scene daily, this just in, word to Haley. I write about the world around me like a journalist it's funny how people that don't listen to me concerned with this is because they have to be these motherfuckers weak at a muscle atrophy this life is like a simulation man it has to be walk through the world the whole shit is just one giant catastrophe speak oh i like this man i like this let's see sorry i want to pay attention to this song so give me one second Sorry about that. Rescheduling an interview with the Mef singer. She's got to come back on Wednesday and not tomorrow. So it is what it is, man. That's what this stuff is all about, man. Things change. Got to be flexible in this, in this business, man. I love what I do, and I'm very proud of my job. I'm very proud of the fact that I'm able to get bands and artists on my show. It's not easy. It's hard work. Back to the song. Mental health and people laugh at me. That's why I tapped out. Retire because I felt wrapped out. Feel like people more connected with shit that's not what rap's about. I like that he addressed his retirement that's smart so i mapped out just me and my fam i don't give a damn living day to day just like the normal man i am bringing it back to the reason i began it from the start spitting syllables at will at the open mic after dark hanging with cats that stay with the iron like they tony stark we recognize when the phonies talk why wow. real g's flying silence like nats g7 raps retired now i'm back i'm really real g's flying silence like nets i like that <laughs> i don't know if that's good or not but i liked it it was Laps. we bringing that heat back like july that real shit no two ply bitches i've been plotting and planning fuck whatever they've been demanding i grabbed a cannon and ran in the lyrical phantom jumping out the plane tandem flow so effortless it seems like it happens at random my green expand bigger i bruce banner on my hit you with the buckshot then the Chappelle slug hustle music like some of my brothers still hustle drugs i'm the unsung did it Ooh, man this is a good song Good pick, Jake. For money made the money, now I do it for fun. Music will forever be a part of me. I do this from the heart, from the circumflex artery. My bank account is seven digits like I won the lottery. But that don't navigate the way I shape the game like pottery. So hold up, grab the gap, reload up, rap, happy my soldiers. Yeah, I'm older, but I'll be wise. I'm fucking around to open your eyes up. Now these haters claim I fell from grace a couple years back. Still at the top where I've been at. Eight miles from the surface of earth and the infinite. Don't gotta get into that. Who's the illness on the track? Rewind it now and listen back. This is a dope song. Um, is that him when he was a kid, or is that just some rando ass kid with a fire chain on? Wanna know who the best is? I give you 44 guesses. It doesn't matter, and it never did. It never does. It never will. That's what. That's true. The best. It doesn't matter who you listening to. That's what matters. 
Look, I'm going to be real blunt. It's going to piss some people off. But Juice World is not the greatest, okay? But he's who I listen to all the time. Like, the greatest rapper? The greatest rappers are... It's a very subjective argument. As a matter of fact, I can't even say Juice World's not the greatest. I don't fucking know or care. He might be your favorite. He might be your greatest. You know? Yeah, so I probably just pissed off a bunch of people without even giving a shit. It doesn't even matter. Why I retired, it's impossible to fulfill. Just a hamster wheel full of cast that never sits still. Oh shit, sorry. I do that all the time. Yeah, man. But like whoever whoever's the greatest, it just so doesn't matter at all. Like Juice World, people say he's the he's like the greatest of all time. And I just don't get it because I don't think that he is. But like, does that matter if he's getting all the like like here's an example? XXX Tentacion is objectively not the greatest, but look how many streams that dude's got. You know, I guess you guess you could equate that to the greatest, but I don't. That's not how I measure greatness. So that's that's what it is. Is how do you measure greatness? Because you might measure in a way that does say Juice World or XXX Tentacion, or maybe you think Tupac and Biggie. Maybe it's Nas. Maybe it's Eminem because he's lyrical and logic because of that. You know what I'm saying? It's very subjective. Who's your greatest? Who's the greatest to you? Let me know in the comments down below. Let me have your top three. Yeah, your top th fuck it, top five dead or alive in the comments below. Top five dead or alive. I want to have hip hop and R and B exclusively. We can do rock and roll stuff on another on another song. Who's your top five dead or alive, man? Thank you so much for your participation. Thank you for so much for your time. I love you guys, man. Come holler at your boy, okay? Let me know if you need anything. Have a good day. Peace.